just briefly, I mean, what has your experience been like filming in this time and this, like having to deal with that behind the scenes as well as on camera? It's interesting because we're all here together, right? So we're all like in this. And there, so is there that herd mentality that where you're just like, yes, we're here, we can handle this, you know, because we're in this together and no one can escape this. And at the same time, even though we are here, we have masks, we have the barrier. Some people have the shield, some people, like, you know, depending on like make a, they'll put on the whole get up. And then when we sit together in our green room, there are these plastic sheets in between all of us. So it's, we're here together, but we're, we're so separated. We're still kind of isolated. You know, look, we're having this conversation on Zoom and we've had to find new ways of connection and nothing beats human connection in your face or touch. Like not, and, and I think we are seeing that now um, as in our technological <laughs> era and social media, which is a, is a blessing. And it's also, you know, just showing us that it's not actually going to replace the connection that we so desperately need. And I, I, and I really hope it's, it's showing us that, that we really do need each other and that to de- be able to depend on each other and rely on each other and to, is not needy in that negative sense. You know, it's not something to, to, that makes us weak, but makes us vulnerable in a way that actually builds us up and makes us stronger. And yeah, so I hope our, sh- I know our show will reflect that as it usually does. And I, and I, and I pray that that's one of the many blessings, you know, that, that COVID-19 might be bringing us as a globally. I mean, I, I will tell you that when you're part of a cast, and this is probably too honest, but when you're part of a cast, to some degree or or the other, there is this proper etiquette. There is this, um, this, if if, if you're genuinely a team player, there's, and it does, it's not necessarily an obligation. It's just the way that it is. You, you, you have to show up for one another from time to time. You have to be there for one another. And whether it's a gathering to see someone, a screening of someone's short or whether it's just game night, you know, we've got some new people who've joined the cast, let's have a game night, let's get to know each other. Or maybe it's just, let's go celebrate so-and-so's birthday or whatever the case is. And a lot of times, the way that we expressed that within our first two seasons was we just showed up, whether it was Road Day wanting to watch the game at Joey's, even though half of us don't really care about the game, we showed up. Or whether it was you know, um, Miller had a birthday, you know, had a birthday and everybody had an idea for what we should do for the birthday. You know, we did what Miller wanted to do. You know what I mean? And COVID-19 has kind of like created, it it is, we're all learning this new discipline is like, how do we let one another know? And the reason you do it, I want to, let me preface with the reason that we do this is because even though we all have our own lives, it's important to let your cast members and people that you're going to be working with for potentially years know that, you care. It's just, it's just, it's, it, it's important. And so uh, COVID-19 is like this new discipline. It's like this whole new thing of like learning, how can I express that? How can I let it be known that I am there for you uh, without being able to show up and have a drink with you or without being able to show up and give you a hug or without being able to just show up and walk your dog for you while you're, you know what I mean? It's all new. And so we're all kind of in the process of figuring out and learning the new way to express um, our appreciation for one another while having to deal with these physical barriers. And I think that a lot of the world is going through that right now. 